Hey guys, welcome to my YouTube channel. Another episode of Try Hack Me. Uh, today we're going to do part two of the vulner upload vulnerabilities. I think I'm going to do a part three for Task 11 Challenge. It does take a while. So let's get right into it. Task 7 Bypassing Client Size Filtering. So, first thing I did was see the question and answer the questions below what is the flag in var www hit the script is in the client side filter.js file either prevent this file from being loaded or read the code to see what mime type is accepted and bypass the filter using method of three so let's make this bigger First thing you do is you go to the website and let's take the source code, page source code, and the hint says client side filter. And file type is image PNG. Same thing as the example is image JPEG. Okay. So you, there's two ways to do this if I remember is first let's load burp sweep and let's run GoBuster with the Java so it popped up image so it's, let's check load all right let's check <clears throat> that's directory yes and let's go here let's open another tab all right so i think i nano this already i just want to make sure Yeah, so that's my attack out box ID 10101120210. Okay, so what I'm going to do is rename this Oops. I'm going to rename this to PHP reverse show PNG. Okay. Next is first we load it and we can go to the request interception rule. Same like in the example, we're going to delete PNG. Let's try that. Okay, so let's turn this on. Firefox. Turn this on. And select a file. And documents. And upload. File successfully uploaded. Oops, I forgot the turn. Let's try again. There you go. Oops, come on. So files to suddenly upload it. Sometimes it doesn't work. So you gotta clear the history cache for the website, which is uh, Control F5. So if you look at the example, it says change to PHP, right? So we're going to change back to PHP. So PHP, and then this one's going to be text slash x dash PHP. And then we're just going to forward. 
and that's it. Let's see. So images is there. You go. That's in. We're gonna netcat lvnp one two three four and click on PHP. There you go, guys. So cd var ww ls flat cat flat. And that is the answer. Cool. Let's go task eight bypassing server side filtering file extensions. Answer questions below was the flag in var www. Comments do not start with a dash, just use the word itself. Okay. So, again, what's this website? Let's go to the website, Annex. The next is, let's exile this. I'm gonna go Buster Annex. So it's privacy, just check. Okay, so that's the directory. And if you follow the example, it talks about different file extensions. So first we check out the JPEG. Um, so I'm select, I did have JPEG, mountains and upload. Upload successfully, so it, it takes JPEG file. Uh, let's try PNG. Successfully too. Okay. Now, change it back to PHP because that we need to have as a PHP so uh, back to a PHP so select and upload so it doesn't work so it's as you follow along the example, you can have two file functions. So it was show JPEG PHP. So you can keep trying out or you can try out every file extension and you'll come up with this one. So it's going to be PHP Rochelle then uh, P there you go. All right, you're gonna come up with this uh, file it's PNG PNG dot PHP and upload. Oh, duh, my bad. It's a uh, PNG five. There you go. Select. There you go, guys. So that's it. You could try all these file functions and you will get this answer PNG dot 
PHP 5, then same routine, going to NC and V and P one, two, three, four, and that should be it. There you go. So I hope my head is in the So CD var list and cat flag and that's the answer guys. Alright, task nine bypassing server side filtering magic numbers. Same thing, grab the flag from var. So again, let's stop this. So magic. Okay, so follow the example, right? In the website, and then you're gonna go buster it. So graphics and assets. So type graphics, don't have the permission. Okay. So it talks about different, what kind of file is it? So, I'm gonna change it back to to PHP file and then what file is that PHP reverse so it's a PHP script and let's see can you upload this it's probably not gonna work but it says GI GIFs only so there's a link right here, right after this first screenshot. It's a Wikipedia page with all the files files enter. As you scroll down, there's a GIF. So it's this. 47, 49, 46, 38, 37, 61. So we're gonna change file which is what's it nano so example it says put four A's but there's six numbers so we're gonna put six A's I think that's six A's right here okay so we're gonna open hex editor. Hex. Do we have that? Nope. So we got installed it in curses hex edit. Nope. So basically we're changing the file of those. which is relatively simple. So the challenge is gonna take a little bit more time. So I'm gonna make a three part video because I find it longer videos more than 10, 15 minutes. It's kind of hard to keep track of concentration. So we're gonna hex edit. What's that PHP viewers? Shell.php. There we go. 
So what was it again? It's 47, 49, 46. Okay, so 47, 49, 46. Let's see, 38, 37, 61. Okay, so let's exit and save. And let's upload this select. You can also recheck what type of file is it? See, it says Jeff. Upload. Nice. So you can't. So you can't access directory. So what you can do is. Was again graphics, right? So graphics was a PHP reverse shell dot PHP. And there you go, guys. Was it CD var ww? Voila. There you go, guys. Task nine complete. And then task 10, example methodology. And um, yeah, you just need, I think you just need to read through this. So read example methodology complete. All right, guys, that's it for this video. You like this? Keep it Please give a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification button. I believe this is the last video for uh, Web Fundamentals, I think. Yes, the last for Web Fundamentals Learning Path. So enjoy this video. Uh, thanks for watching. Till next time.